Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. My name is Nas. And I'm Alba, and we are in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. In this video, we're gonna take you guys with us to Batu Caves, which many people say is the best day activity in Kuala Lumpur. Yes, we're gonna show you how to get there. We're gonna tell you how much it costs and tell you a little bit about the history of Batu Caves. Yeah, and at the end of the day, you can make a decision whether this is something that looks like the best thing to do in Kuala Lumpur. So, come along! The best way to get to Batu Caves is by train. Kuala Lumpur has a great public transport network and it's very affordable, so take advantage of it during your visit. There is a direct train from KL Central, but if you're staying elsewhere in the city, you can just take a different metro or train to connect you with the KTM Line 1 that will take you directly to Batu Caves. Right, we made it. When you get off the train station, you only have to walk a couple of meters and then you already start seeing uh, different temples, uh, street shops, so you know you're in the right place. And then you walk a little bit more and then you'll finally find the stairs, which look amazing. Now we need to go up them, um, but first you need to make sure that uh, you have the right dress code, of course. Um, I might need to put a jacket on and I can prepare the long trousers, so let's go. <laughs> <laughs> the stairs are quite steep and to be honest it's giving me a bit of vertigo so just Take your time to go up them. But you know, we're not even halfway through and we cannot, you can already see the skyline of the city. Yeah. And it's really, really amazing. Let's go, let's keep going up. It's definitely scary, all them stairs. So these rocks you see right here, they're almost 400 million years old. Yeah, that's, that's old. Um, but Batu Caves is one of the most famous Hindu shrines outside of India. So that's one of the reasons to why it's so famous. Um, and at the same time, if you look at it, it kind of resembles uh, the kind of the rock formations that you see in El Nido in the Philippines. Um, and we really, really like the way it looks. So we're back on the train, uh, we were there uh, between one and two hours, uh, just kind of enjoying and seeing around, but now we're gonna go get food to uh, Lot 10 Hudong Food Court. Yes, which and I'm, I'm starving, I cannot <laughs> wait. A lot of people have recommended, so hopefully it'll be nice. Yes. 
These are the cards we got to use the train. Yes, and you have to make sure you keep them because to come here we pay 10 ringgit per person. Yeah. Because we paid for the cards and the journey. Yeah. And now we already had the cards, so we only paid for the journey, which was in total four ringgit, so two each. So I guess we paid eight for the card. Yeah. Um, but now we have them. We're gonna come back to Kuala Lumpur um, after our travels, so we'll keep them. <laughs> yeah. touch it um, but basically it's vegetarian clay pot they made it for me especially <laughs> um, so I'm super excited to try it I've never had this it looks great it's good I really like it Okay, so I was very excited about our food. I'm very excited about mine too. Uh, this is like some noodles with some braised beef. At least that's what I read. Um, but yeah. He doesn't even know what he's eating. Both There's of so us, much. both of us paid 15 ringgit each. Yeah. So pretty affordable too. Yeah. There's just so much food that like we've never tried, so we don't know what is what. We're just like, let's try it all. After spending a great morning exploring Batu Caves and then eating at Lot 10, mm -hmm. uh, we decided to come back uh, and go to the swimming pool because we were dripping in sweat. It's so hot. Oh, it's so hot. And that was quite a lot of walking in the heat. So this was much needed. Um, but unfortunately, our time in Kuala Lumpur is coming to an end for now because we will be coming back. Yeah. Uh, and we're gonna be flying out to Langkawi pretty soon mm -hmm. so make sure you stick around because we're gonna have amazing new vlogs of the island the island in the north of Malaysia absolutely so subscribe make sure you don't miss out um, thank you guys so much for watching thank you for being here and see you in our next video mm -hmm.